how can we as a community allow this to happen? Tatiana Campia lives in State College and says she has a tough time making ends meet because of the rent prices here. Former Borough Council President Evan Myers says her story is all too familiar. There are students in this town that are homeless. There are students who live in their cars. The university oftentimes refuses to acknowledge that, but it does exist because there aren't enough affordable places for them to live. Council passed a resolution last week to promote affordable housing in Center County. Goals include working with nonprofits to develop a tenant advocacy system as well as legal representation. Also, creating a public database to display public records and to update zoning to promote new affordable housing. The borough really has no authority to uh, pass legislation that would require uh, landlords to do certain things other than for safety, but we can't uh, pass rent control, things like that. The state legislature can do that. According to Myers, there should be more affordable housing options in high rises like the one behind me. However, in Center County, they seldom exist. That, in essence, is what the resolution is aiming to fix. Campia says rent is just too expensive. I was making roughly $1,200 a month. Um, my rent was $925 a month, which at the end of the day, after paying for bus, car, food, utilities, left me with practically peanuts <laughs> to live the rest of my days. But there's optimism among council that its resolution may help provide short-term change and that state lawmakers will also take action. In State College, I'm Michael Dubaton for the Center County Report.